Well, breaking news for those who are applying to the international dentist program in the United States, you've got to make sure that you know the dental schools that you're applying to. In Northern California, there are two dental schools in San Francisco, the University of Pacific and the University of California, San Francisco. Figure out which school you'd like to go to. And there is no purpose really to apply to too many schools, except for you want to get in and it doesn't matter what school you get into. Both programs used to offer the two-year programs. UOP offers a two-year program for dentists who got their dental education in a different country than the United States. University of California, San Francisco also have that two-year program, but this coming up year, 2024-2025, the, the new class for the University of California, San Francisco, they are now a three-year program. Now, how do I know this? It's because you could go into, you know, Google would be a good uh, resource for these type of things. And if you go to the San Francisco, University of California, San Francisco uh, site, and then you type in the, um, you type in dentistry, international dental pathway for UCSF, you'll get into their site, and then you'll notice that the incoming admission cycle of 2024 and 2025, they are now a three-year program track. And then now if you want to compare that to the University of the Pacific, they are a two-year program. So when you're applying to these uh, programs, make sure that you do your research as to which school you want to apply to. It's important to know and, and find out and, and know about the school that you want to get into because you've got to prepare for this. Now, we're going to get into the cycle of 2025 to 2026. Now, we are just right now local here in California, Arnold Palos, Dr. Palos, practicing in Northern California. I went to the University of California, San Francisco Dental School, been practicing for 30 years, and I've had a lot of dentists come through my office, a lot of dentists, a lot of dental assistant who became dentists. And so I know that, I know the path that they have to go through, and, and, and it's not the easiest path that you have to go through, but it's like I was always telling them, it's a simple path. They give you, you go to their site, they're gonna tell you uh, what you need to know to apply. They've got information on the qualification that you have to meet. And what I always try to preach to the students who are gonna be applying the dentist from another country who wants to be a dentist in the United States. There is a particular time that you wanna get all your information together apply early, be prepared, and strengthen your application. The more you are strengthening your application, the better chance you will have in getting into the school that you wanna get into. So one of the things that you wanna make sure that you do is do your research, figure out which school you'd like to go to. And there is no purpose really to apply to too many schools except for you want to get in and it doesn't matter what school you get into. But I'm telling you this, if you've got good GPA, you've got good test scores, if you've got the, the credentials from the country that you went into, the dental school that you went into, and then you're able to go ahead and bring that to the United States and then show that how much interested you are in learning how we do dentistry in the United States, being able to go and work in a dental office, being able to volunteer in the community, making sure that whoever is giving you that uh, letter of recommendation, they know you, they know what you're all about, and they could vouch for the character that you've got and the kind of clinician that you will be when you become a dentist here in the United States. So make sure you're doing your research. Make sure that in, in our state, in the city of San Francisco, there are two dental school that have two different programs. 
UOP is a private university. UCSF, University of California, San Francisco is a public university. And they've got different requirements in terms of how many years you're gonna be there. UCSF now, go into their website. They are offering a three-year program only. And UOP is still offering a two-year program where they, they split their group of students uh, that is going to be practicing in San Francisco. Now, and I believe they have a program also that, that, that is in their new clinic in the Central Valley of California, the city of Sacramento. And so make sure that you are doing your research. This is a good time when you're going to go ahead and apply for that cycle, which is coming up 2024 and 25 is on the way you are gonna make sure that you are knowing what is required for 2025-26 class and be ready for that application process. Make sure you're watching our next video and subscribe right here to make sure that you know everything that you need to know to strengthen your application when you are applying to dental school as a foreign dentist wanting to practice in the United States. So make sure, subscribe and watch our next video.